the favorite in the women's competition, Shannon Miller. And our Gail Gardner had a chance to catch up with this Olympic superstar, the 15-year-old Shannon Miller. Shannon Miller, Kim Zemeskel. It was a rivalry fueled by the press that reached its climax at the Barcelona Games. With billions of eyes watching all over the world, it was Miller who came away with the spoils. But has success spoiled Shannon Miller? That hardly seems to be the case. A perfect full twisting double somersault and she rocks the landing. Comes the dismount, stick it, oh! and she's got it! Wow. Going in, I really didn't know what to expect. I wanted to hit my routines, so I trained really hard to do that. And I was happy with what I did. And it was great bringing five medals back to the U.S. Yeah! Well, I truly believe that Shannon's the best gymnast that the USA has ever produced. She certainly stole the show in Barcelona, the shining star on the U.S. bronze medal team. Eight months later, new car in tow, Shannon is back to the basics that brought her to unparalleled heights, more Olympic medals than any other female athlete in Barcelona. Since her return, things have never and really can never be the same. Welcome to Shannonville, formerly Edmond, Oklahoma. Shannon, Shannon everywhere, even in commercials. Sports and leisure. <clears throat> what woman won the most medals in the 1992 Olympics? I don't want to brag, but... The Trivial Pursuit Year in Review Edition. Is anyone not playing this game? At Dynamo Gymnastics, both Shannon and longtime coach Steve Nuno live up to that name. Slow down the hurdle, though. Yeah, nice run coming in. Run came in, then you went hurdle, slow down. You hurdle forward and pick up the momentum coming back. Motivation that, that she's gotten from me has been, in my opinion, uh, given to her every time she does something. And I think that she feeds off that. I think she feeds off the, the understanding that I want what's best for her, and I'm willing to tell her right out what she's going to have to do to, to be the best. Discipline and tenacity are Shannon's trademarks. She is now training with Kerry Strug, a former Bella Caroli protege. And the union has had a positive effect on both gymnasts. Shannon, finally out from the shadow of another Caroli disciple, Kim Zemeskel, is now alone in the spotlight, but barely thinks about it. Even though Kim retired, I don't think that's any less motivation because that's not where I got my motivation all last year and the years before that. It's from me wanting to do, to do the best I can and from my coaches and family supporting me all through gymnastics. But I think um, Carrie Strug is at our gym now and she's pushing me to do my best every day. Training and school leave some time for signing autographs with her mother and answering the tons of fan mail that she gets and playing with her dog, Dusty. But always looming for Shannon is the specter of the glorious past and the possibilities that still may lie ahead. Nice job. 